Hello Pokemon trainers, welcome to Moments in Championship History, a series where you will learn about the most exciting stories throughout the history of competitive Pokemon. Today we'll be focusing on an incredible deck that combines an unlikely trio of cards. This is a combination that you would not think would synergize well together, but as it turns out, they formed a partnership worthy of a World Championship title. I'm referring to none other than Robin Schulz or ArcGX Carburetor deck, which combined three of the most powerful cards ever printed. I think uh, one of my strengths uh, at this game is building decks and uh, choosing the right decks for tournaments. I think I'm quite good at like seeing what's important in a matchup between two decks and uh, seeing how it should play out in theory and then checking the theory in uh, practice. The first card was Garbodor from the Breakpoint set. It was a very effective way to stop your opponent's strategies by shutting down all the abilities with its own Garbotoxin ability, as long as it had a tool card attached such as Floatstone. Next, the other Garbodor from the Guardian's Rising set with a powerful Trash Alliance attack, dealing damage based on the amount of item cards in your opponent's discard pile. This card alone completely changed how trainers built their decks and played the game, as many powerful item cards such as Ultra Wall, Field Blower and Puzzle of Time that were played back then were now a liability and would increase the damage that this Garbodor could do. And finally, the glue that brought everything together, Zoroark GX and its trade ability, allowing trainers to discard a card from their hand and draw two cards. With multiple Zoroark GX in play, you could draw up to 8 extra cards each turn, allowing you to find key resources like Guzma Racerola at just the right moment. This formidable card already had three international titles to its name with different partners. Tord Reklev won the 2018 European International Championship by combining Zoroark GX with Kalisopa GX and then won the 2018 Ocean International by pairing it with Gardevoir GX. And finally, Stefan Ivanov was crowned champion at the 2018 North America International Championship with the same unlikely trio of Zoroark GX and the two Garbodors that would then go on to become world champions. Now why is it an unlikely trio you ask? Well this Garbodor shuts down abilities, while Zoroark GX's best asset is how many extra cards it grants you each turn with its ability trait. So how was Robin able to make these two unlikely friends work so well together in the same deck at the World Championships in Nashville? The answer comes in many forms, but the main one is, you want to take advantage of all these powerful cards at the right time. Draw as many cards as possible with multiple Zora GXs, shut down abilities when it's convenient for you, and deal more and more damage with each item card your opponent decides to play. In game 1 of his top 4 match against Clive, Robin won by using a Tapulele GX with 3 double colorless energy attached to 1 KO a Zygarde GX. During game 2, Robin decided to hold off on evolving into Garbodor until the last possible second. And after playing a devastating end to 1, in combination with shutting down all abilities, Robin was able to start an amazing comeback with powerful Trash Alange and Riders beating attacks to make his way into the finals. On Championship Sunday, Robin adjusted his strategy to start limiting his opponent's abilities as soon as possible against the very ability-reliant Malamar deck, as that deck needed to continually use Psychic Recharge every turn to power up its powerful attackers. Robin didn't hesitate, and as soon as the second turn of Game 1, he decided to shut down all abilities with Garbotoxin. The lock has been established, turn 2 Garbotoxin for Robin and utilize Zora GX with its Psychic Resistance as a bulky and powerful attacker dishing out a lot of damage with its Riders beating attack. Robin Schultz takes game number one. Game two was more of the same. A perfect second turn from Robin Schultz. It's gonna take a two prize knockout, lock down the abilities. And even though it was a bit closer this time around, Robin was able to lock down the Psychic Recharge abilities long enough to walk away with victory. That is it, Robin Schultz is the 2018 Masters Division World Champion. Turns out combining three of the most powerful and threatening cards ever printed was the perfect strategy for Robin Schultz to be crowned the 2018 Pokemon TCG World Champion. Thank you so much for watching, we hope you enjoyed learning about the history of this crazy deck. Make sure to let us know some of your favorite moments in Pokemon TCG history by using the hashtag PlayPokemon.